called simple RSA. And when we download the file, we're given um, the output and we see um, some N values, E values, and the CT values. There's a bunch of these. So um, these um, CT values must be separated for some reason. So how about let's put them um, into a file. So write a script to solve this. So equals this and we we'll replace all the spaces with um this and a new line. Save it, uh, yeah. Print the text. Let's dump all of these numbers into a file. So, um, our theory is that let's test this out. Um, having the values of CT, maybe we can, um, we can test the RSA algorithm on each of them with NE and each of these numbers and combine all of them to get the flag. So let's try that. Let's write a Python script to do this. So um, let's first get down with the inverse function. So let's copy this, this function here. Let's place it at the top of the script. Also put um, let's open up this file and read it, um, and then for line and F, so every line we can um, test the RSA algorithm and of decryption on it so we can first specify the n values c values and e values okay and then p q we'll just take that by um putting n into factor db so let's just put this into factor db so this would be p and then this here would be q okay so now we have that we need to start um writing our script um, we need a value of d, which is, um, let's change this function to inverse, inverse the values. We set a value of phi, who will be equal to p minus 1 times the value of q minus 1. Oops. There, and inverse e and phi. That would be d and the message be the value of convert um, this to hex and then let's put this into a list and then Write a script. Um, we need to replace everything. So we need to replace zero x with nothing, so that they don't get jambled up and they don't all have zero x in them. We are done writing our script, let's save it and let's run it.
Oops, we have an error. Save that, let's try to run it again. And we'll get all these numbers. How about let's put all these in Cyber Chef? Take a while, but we'll get there and we get our flag. Now, I'm currently not able to submit flags at the moment because the bot's offline for some reason and the round just ended. But this is our flag. Um, and that's how you solve the challenge.